Hi everybody and welcome back to another studio vlog. It is me, Krista from the future. My hair is completely different but we'll get into that more later. Basically I just wanted to pop it in and explain a little bit what this video is going to be like because it needs some explaining. As I was filming a lot of the clips for this I did not pop onto camera very often and you'll see in the next clip when I did actually pop on the camera. I wasn't really feeling myself. I was pretty stressed and yeah I, I was breaking out I didn't put on any makeup and I just felt really uncomfortable and therefore did not go on camera very often so here I am future me here to explain that this video is gonna be a lot of painting a lot of me changing the space that I'm in right now um, so yeah and without further ado we can hop back into it but thanks for being here I hope you enjoy the video and uh, yeah I'll see you later Hi everybody! Excuse me, I look like actual poo. Jess is here, she's helping me tape right now. Say hi! Hi! So we just have to finish taping the room. The drop sheets are all down, if you can see them. And then we are going to begin painting and I'm super excited and we'll take you along with us.
So amongst all the craziness of moving and trying to get my room all set up, I also was working on shop stuff as well. And one of the things that I did during this time was design a recycle sticker for my new glassine bags, which you would have seen in one of my previous videos. My glassine bags or glacine, however you say it, they're completely recyclable and I wanted people to be aware of that. So I created these stickers. Now these are kind of just a temporary fix because I'm not actually 100% sure about the recyclability of these stickers. These stickers have like no plastic in them or anything. They're just craft paper, but then they do have a little bit of adhesive. So I'm hoping that they would be recyclable. And if not, again, they're just temporary. So in the future, I'm hoping to have ink stamps. I finally got on top of all of my Etsy orders and all of my Patreon happy mails and just laying them all out on my bed like this. I'm kind of speechless. Like, how are there this many of them? I can't wait to get these out to you guys. This is crazy. If you have placed an order or are a patron, I freaking love you. Just wanted you to know. So I definitely hope to do a better video later when this is a lot more complete, but for now, this is kind of what I'm working with. I have my one desk over here and a shelf that I purchased off of Kijiji. And <laughs> this desk is something that I actually bought to be a standing desk. I purchased another one of these trestles. I have another one at my apartment in my other city that I live in and another one of these Alex drawer units. So I'm going to take this Alex drawer unit and pair it with my other Alex drawer unit to have a big desk. And then I'm going to take this trestle thing from Ikea and my other trestle thing from Ikea and use this desktop to make a standing table. So I'm going to have one big desk right there and then a standing table right there. So right now I kind of just have set up my room sort of the way I want it with the furniture that I have available to me. This dresser thingy is my sister's old dresser and it will be out of here. But for now I have a place to put my clothes, which is nice. Um, and then this bed is actually our like guest bed, but I'm using it right now because good to have a bed. Um, some Amazon boxes that I'll be breaking down. I have a whole collection of Amazon boxes under my bed. I like to reuse them, especially for chit chat batches. It works really well to consolidate all my mail into a batch. Yeah, so here's my workstation, my storage on my shelf. I have my trolley right here for now. It works really nice because I can take really nice photos on this tabletop thing. And so this is kind of the side of the room that is basically done, kind of temp done. And then we'll look at the other side. First we'll look up because look at my pretty lights. I love them so much. I have them all over. <laughs> they are LEDs so they don't get hot and they don't use as much electricity. And there's actually, there's a remote. Yeah, and there's different settings. So sometimes I like to just keep it static. And then there's actually two strings of them. So I kind of have to do them both. Anyway, yeah, so those are my lights. Um, they're really nice in the evening when I just kind of want a nice ambient atmosphere. And then we're just gonna ignore this disaster over here. This is my explosive cable management at the moment my heater because it gets so cold in this room. It gets really, really cold in this room. And then clean clothes I have to put away and a bunch of random stuff. That is my room and it's coming along nicely. My silhouette machine is over here. And uh, yeah, it's, it's exciting. I'm excited to get the rest of my furniture because it will completely change the space. Um, I have some big plans, as you guys may have seen in my little Sims video that I made. So, yeah, that's everything.
everybody, it's future Krista again. Thank you for making it to this part of the video. I just wanted to pop in and show you another updated clip of what my room was looking like. At this point, I had gone to my old apartment and I had moved a whole bunch of my furniture. I moved like 90% of my furniture and I will grab the rest of it closer to my actual lease end date. I just decided to accelerate my move because I work remote and just because of COVID and everything, my family is just has been my bubble for the past little while. So it just kind of made it easier to just move here. So I grabbed all my furniture and in this last clip, I started putting some things in their places and started sorting through a whole bunch of junk. So that's kind of what you're seeing here. In my next video, I will be showing a full room tour and I'm so, so excited because I feel like it's really coming together. It's still not 100% done yet, but I feel like with any thing it's just going to be a work in progress and I will keep you guys posted as I add new things to my studio. Thanks for being here. Thank you for watching. I'm really excited to get back on a more regular studio vlog schedule so hopefully after I upload my studio tour I will be on a more week by week studio vlog schedule. That's the goal anyway. So I'll see you guys then. I love you. Your best mama. See you later. Bye.